Hello everybody, Chris Campbell here with Campbell's Stained Glass Creations. So I have a lot of people that have asked me on my YouTube channel, what do I do with the um, bulk glass that I discard after cutting out my designs? Well, that's a good question because these can actually be used for other projects. I don't throw them away. Um, if it's big enough, I can keep it and use it for other projects such as uh, mosaic um, stained glass windows eyes, um, fill-ins, you name it. So I'm going to show you how I preserve these and to do this I'm going to be putting on my gloves because these are razor sharp glass. They have been cut and I have been cut more times than I care to describe. So <clears throat> what we have here are two pieces of glass. Now this has got some sharp edges here, here, and especially along here. Now what you want to do is use 220 grit paper. And what you want to do is run it across it in an angle to remove the sharpness. Go over the top, back down, all the way through. And do it kind of like in an angle. <clears throat> do both sides. And there we go. Okay. And then come back across. And now we're going to rotate it a little bit and get this side, and this side. Okay, so that's one. Now we're going to do the second one. Okay, that's two. And last, we'll just do this one for right now to show you what I'm talking about. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> All right. So now we've smoothed the edges on both sides. So that one's good. This one is smooth and clean. And this one here is also smooth without a sharp point or edge. You can rub your fingers across it. Now for this, I'll probably end up using these for mosaic uh, window art. And I can also cut them out if I need to when I'm making the fish sun catcher for the eyes. Um, so I can actually cut circles and make the eyes out of them. But when you're dealing with stained glass that is 10 to $12 for an 8 by 10 piece of glass, it's always best to keep what you can of your um, discarded pieces and use them for later projects. Uh, because this is money. And you can always use this for other projects. So I hope that helps you. Um, again, I'm using this regular 220 uh, grit paper. And that's it here, 220. And that's how we do um, cleaning. And I'm going to show you with my bare hands. It is smooth to the touch. There's no rough edges. It is completely smooth. That's what you want. Just a smooth piece all the way around. So this can actually be used over and over and over for different projects. And I would say just in these three shoots here alone, this is about $5 worth of glass. So you do not want to throw this away once you've cut out your pattern of whatever piece you're making because you can actually use this in future other patterns. So stay tuned for my other creations. Have a wonderful evening.